We would like two lemonades, please. That'll be 50 cents. 50 cents? I ain't paying no 50 cents for no lemonade. You expect us to pay for this? Well... Of course she does. But we have a right to drink lemonade. It's a God-given right, Billy. The word right is thrown around a whole lot these days. Whether it's the right to freedom of speech, the right to own a gun, the right to use birth control, the right to health care, or any other thing we're told we're entitled to. Some people seem to think they have a right to just about anything and everything. So what is a right? Well, it means you get to do something. Well, sort of. Rights are a moral concept that define the expectations and responsibilities we all have towards each other, based on the idea that every individual person's life, choices, and property are their own. They're not something that governments can give out to people, but something people are born with and that any good government shouldn't be allowed to take away. Which... Who said anything about the government? I ain't talking about no government. I just want some free lemonade. Well, yeah, but the only way that you can get something for free that somebody else doesn't want to give away is to either have the government take it from them or just steal it. But I repeat myself. Hello, 911? Yes, I have a little girl refusing to give me free lemonade from her lemonade stand. Hello? What are my taxes paying for? See, if you have a right to the product of her labor, that means she had to go through the process of creating it without being compensated. What? Well, why not just have taxes pay for it? That way she gets compensated for making a lemonade and I get lemonade without having to buy it. Everybody wins! Yeah, but then you're just taking money from someone else who wasn't even involved in the transaction and doesn't get anything in return. And besides, it's her lemonade. She might not even want to sell it to you. Yeah, I... Oh, next you're gonna be saying that people should get to decide what happens with their own stuff? Pfft. Uh, yeah. No one's saying you don't have a right to drink whatever you want, but that's not the same as saying you have a right to just take other people's stuff. For example, no one told you that you couldn't get plastic surgery, but you still have to find a way to pay for those butt implants yourself. You said you would never tell! Hey! Anything we consider to be a human right has to be universal and equal for everyone. And that means whatever treatment you think you're entitled to from others should be something you're prepared to respect for them in return. A right to life means it's never okay to murder or assault anyone else. A right to liberty means everybody gets to say and do what they want as long as they don't try to stop someone else from being able to do the same. A right to property, ahem, means nobody steals from each other and everybody gets to decide for themselves what to do with their stuff. If they don't want to trade with you or give you their property voluntarily, you don't just get to take it away. But your supposed right to my lemonade is just another way of saying you think you have the moral authority to take my stuff. What are you trying to say here? Give me my 50 cents, jerk! Human rights don't really mean anything if they aren't equal for all people. But when we all agree to respect other people's rights, we get to live in a society that's stable, peaceful, and increasingly prosperous. And who wouldn't want that? Thank you so much for watching. If you enjoyed this video and want more material like it, check out feed.org.